Hey y'all, this is Southern Woods here. Welcome to another Ages of Conflict War Simulation. Last time around, I did it on national fast food chains, seeing which one of those fast food chains would own America, and y'all seem to really enjoy that. So this time around, I'm doing it with national sub shop chains. Yeah, there's not as many of them out there. There's only about nine that I felt like I could put on this list. And like last time, they are... Uh, placed upon where they were founded, so Subway up there in the Northeast, Witch Witch in Texas, Firehouse Subs around Jacksonville, Florida, and then their size or their starting area is based upon uh, their revenue from the past year as well, so of course Subway, Jimmy John's pretty huge, but places like uh, Schlotzky's and Blimpy are really, really small in comparison. Another thing, as you can see, there's none on this west coast. Um, there may be pretty big chains out west um, that are primarily out west that I don't know about, but I know about all these guys, and they're mainly on the east coast or in, uh, you know, like the Midwest. So we'll see how this goes. Um, my little prediction is that whoever, like, there's going to be a big battle out east. And whoever wins is going to end up facing Quiznos. Because look, they have all this land they can grab up out west. They may not be the biggest starting out, but they have the best opportunity, I feel like, based on geography. Geography is huge in war, and this is no different in this simulation. Let's get it started. Up. Put in the comments, what's your favorite sub shop? Uh, who do you want to win? Already we have Jersey Mike's going against Subway. Out here, um, they peace out momentarily. Firehouse Sub's going to get that deep south. Jimmy John's has a lot of this mid-northwest. Quiznos slowly expanding. All right, they're working their way. But Schlotsky's kind of pushing quicker. Meanwhile, Blimpy, they got taken out by Subway that kind of did the reach around over here. Uh, Potbelly conquered Witch Witch. Wow. Which which the superior sub, not superior in this type of war simulation. Quiznos finally able to cut off Schlotzky's out here. Um, now they're going to go to war with each other. Now we got Subway pushing into uh, South Carolina, going against Firehouse Subs. Quiznos having their way against Schlotzky's. It looks like they're going to be able to take them out. Ooh, they peace out last second because Jimmy John's is now going against Quiznos because Quiznos ran out of economy. Interesting how this is setting up. Already my prediction failed. So Quiznos just fell to Jimmy John's, which is going to get a lot of this territory. Schlotzky's may be able to um, get some of that back. But uh, Firehouse Subs was conquered by Subway. So Subway's going to uh, crawl into Georgia and in Florida. Oh, Schlotzky's got taken out by Jimmy John. So now they're going to have sole control out west. Unless maybe Potbelly can uh, uppercut him real quick over here. And it looks like that's what they may try to do. Alright. So again, who's your favorite sub shop? We only have three left already. Potbelly, Jimmy John's, and Schlotzky's. Or Subway. <laughs> I don't know why I said Schlotzky's. But Potbelly looks like uh, they're going to get taken out by Jimmy John's. So it's going to be Subway versus Jimmy John's. Probably the top two in real life. Um... Jimmy John's had to hold off on its conquering of the West Coast because they ran out of economy and now Subway's going to swoop in. Okay, well, that's probably the quickest simulation we've ever done. I mean, not that many uh, teams, but Subway, even though you know they didn't have the best uh, geological advantage, was able to just take advantage of everyone else. As we saw, Quiznos and Jimmy John's kind of took too much of their economy moving out west and then uh were able to get taken down so wow that was quick uh so much so that i wasn't even <laughs> able to finish my like opening spiel about you know put in the comments who you want to win who do you want to lose do 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 so well if you enjoyed that and you want me to run it up again uh let me know um in fact let's let's run it up again okay let's restart this Let's do a two for one because that was so short. Um, why not? Uh, you know, why the hell not? Let's see if uh, things end up the same or if they end up drastically different. Yeah, yeah. I can't end y'all with like a five minute video. All right.
All right, we're going to run this up again. All right, and I'm going to go... Yeah, we'll start normal speed again. Let's just see what the hell happens. See if it is similar or drastically different. Uh, right off the bat, again, Jersey Mike's and Subway battling each other out. But now, this time, Jersey Mike's is able to take out Subway. All right. Uh, Potbelly conquered by Jimmy John. So, Potbelly doesn't last nearly as long. Uh, Quiznos able to cut off Schlotsky's a little bit quicker. But Witch Witch trying to take advantage of the moving out west. Okay. All right, so we got a little little different already. Actually, very different if you think about it. The winner was the first one to get knocked out. Um, so, okay. Schlotsky's pushing up into Witch Witch. They want to be the only sub shop in Texas. They will do that with ease. So Witch Witch, once again, gone. They haven't fared well either, either matchup. Quizno's now moving into Schlotsky's, which went bankrupt. Firehouse subs... And Jersey Mike's teaming up against Jimmy John Schlotsky's conquered by Quiznos. So now this is looking more like what I uh, predicted early on at the start of the video. But now Quiznos ran out of economy. So Jimmy John's is going to um, push into them a good bit. And then Firehouse Subs has this uh, bottom tip of Texas as well. So that will be uh, interesting to see how that plays out. Alright, so now Jimmy John's and Firehouse Subs teaming up against Jersey Mike's. A little switcheroo. Let's see. We only have four left again, alright? Very quick. Uh, Quizno is able to push out Firehouse Subs from Texas and actually get some of their Louisiana territory. It's been a stalemate between Quizno's and Jimmy John's for a minute. All right, now everyone's teaming up on Jimmy John's, it seems. Well, now Quiznos is handling the bulk of the load. Wow. Bad time to go bankrupt. Bad time to go bankrupt. Oh, now we have Quiznos turning their sights on Firehouse Subs, which is trying to uh, race into Jimmy John's territory to maybe save them. I don't know. Wow, that was, that was a clusterfuck. So now it's Quiznos and Jersey Mike's. All right, so... Who will end up winning this? Quiznos couldn't fully expand for a minute because they ran out of economy. Let's put this full speed because, of course, this is going to be a pretty long, contentious battle. Or not. Or not. We'll see. Quiznos, of course, one of the biggest sub chains a couple decades ago. They've kind of fallen off a cliff. Now they're one of the smallest national chains out there. Um, but it looks like they may take out Jersey Mike's. We'll see. All right. They, they've they pushed them back to within the 13 colonies. Oh, no. Can Jersey Mike's come back? Oh, they ran out of economy. I don't think that it's going to happen. Quiznos. Well, is this their comeback year, 2024? All right. Maybe this... I don't know. Well, Quiznos won. So... Very different outcomes, all right? The second outcome was more of how I predicted the first one to go. Um, out east, they had to settle um, their differences. One would have to take sole control, and then they'd go against Quiznos, which Quiznos had a good advantage um, and ended up winning. But the first simulation was drastically different. So kind of interesting. If you want me to run up a third one in a later video, let me know. Hit me with that like button if you enjoyed. If you want to see more of these or outdoor videos, food reviews, something to that nature, hit the subscribe button and join the Southern Woods community. Without further ado, y'all, Southern Woods out.